Hey folks, this is Dre Crawford, Recovery One Drones again. Coming to you talking about RTK. I've been fortunate enough to pick up uh, another drone, my M30T, that is RTK compatible, just like my Mavic Enterprise Advance is RTK compatible. So my plan is uh, to try to start using these drones in my business and go forward and doing solar inspections. What I found out recently about RTK is that it's not the same in every state. And that's something we need to talk about that, you know, I'm going to give my, my experience, my advice to you, uh, that check out your local state and look up who runs the RTK system. Is it the state that runs your system or a federal subsidized system, or is it a private uh, third party person or company, I should say, who runs the, the RTK? Here in California, ours is uh, backed by the federal government under the uh, United States uh, Geological Survey Group, which is under the Department of Interior, and basically it's there to monitor seismic activity as far as our earthquakes that we have here. Uh, we may not have a big one, but we always have uh, some type of activity uh, going on all the time. I looked at a couple other states like Florida. Their system falls under the Department of Transportation. Uh, when I looked under the state of Illinois, I uh, could not find anything under the state guidelines, but I did find a third-party vendor who charges a subscription and it only covers the greater, as they say, Chicago land area. So you might want to check into your local uh, state facilities or whatever the case may be and see if you have a RT, RTK system available to you. Like I said, here in California, it's free for us to connect to. You can donate. Uh, but it primarily is free to use, uh, which is nice. We call ours out here the CRTN uh, program network, which is basically means for California real-time network. And then you can go from there. Uh, DJI uh, primarily has about uh, four drones now. Probably have more. Probably the agriculture drones maybe have RTK on them. But we have the, the uh, Mavic Enterprise Advance, the M30 series, the Matrice 210 RTK, and the Matrice 300. And primarily uh, drones that use RTK, also the Phantom, I, some, I won't forget about the Phantom RTK system, is basically used for mapping purposes, for the accuracy that they give you at mapping. It makes it easier when you process the data because what happens is, is that the metadata information is a little more detailed uh, down to one centimeter, so it makes it easier for you to uh, put together the mapping and allows you to be able to do surveying uh, documentation off off your photogrammetry work. Now, my little disclaimer on that, if you are not a licensed surveyor or a principal engineer, do not offer this services as you the one doing the surveying. You can fly the missions, you can do the photogrammetry part, but you, unless you're licensed, I would not advise you to go out there and offer these services as a licensed surveyor or a principal engineer. Uh, once again, this is my little tidbit. I'm not going to be here long. Just let you know that, you know, when you do get this system, if you plan on getting the system, uh, I know it took me a little while to get logged in. Uh, I had to go back and re-watch the video from one of the universities and make sure I did it correctly. I had the information, but sometimes they, they tell you that it may take six or seven tries for the system to recognize your login. So don't get frustrated if it doesn't say connect or it says low low uh, RTK uh, satellites or something like that. And it's one thing I noticed that we talk about the satellite issue, and this is a little off topic, but when we talk about the issues with the Mavic 3, and I'm going to show you here uh, in the login of all the different satellites that your drone picks up, but the RTK system only uses two, regular GPS and GLONASS. So that's the interesting thing. Uh, what the Maverick 3 had at first when it was having this issue as far as getting GPS satellites. So I'm gonna let you guys look at that real quick and then uh, go from there. Once again, this is Dre Crawford, Recovery One Drones. As I always say, hang on, enjoy the ride, and please subscribe. Thank you, bye. <laughs>